is up you guys, it is me Lindsay and I am back with another very special, very epic, very awesome video for you all today. So today I'm going to be reviewing two products from Bath and Body Works, which is one of my favorite stores of all time. I was sent these products for free, but that does in no way change my opinions. All opinions are my own. So the two products I will be reviewing for you guys today are the Japanese Cherry Blossom Lotion and Body Wash. Now, let me just start off by talking about the smell. I think that's a good place to start off. When you first open these packages, the smell is the first thing that you encounter when you experience these two products. The smell is obviously titled Japanese Cherry Blossom, like I said. And on the back of the product, it says that the keynotes are Japanese Cherry Blossom, Asian Pear, Mimosa Petals, White Jasmine, and Creamy Sandalwood. I don't know what any of those things are. I am not a expert on fragrances and notes and that kind of thing. I just know that those notes are what make the smelly smell goodness smell. I would describe this smell as a florally kind of scent, but it is sweet. It's like a sweet smell, but it isn't like a candy smell. It's like a sweet floral smell, if that makes sense. I'm trying my best to describe something that I'm not very good at describing. Did I just get some on my nose? Oh my God, I did. Oh yikes, girl, Lindsay, get your stuff together. I would say it's a very youthful scent. You know, it's like sweeter, so I would say it's younger. If you were into more mature scents, like musky scents, this probably isn't the scent for you, but Bath & Body Works sells so many different fragrances. There is a ton of other smells in Bath & Body Works for you, and they're always changing their products for the season. Right now they have all of their winter smells. Now on to the actual formulation of these two products. This is a lotion with shea and vitamin E. It is a body lotion intended for your body, like it says. I used this yesterday when I popped out of the shower because I am one of those people who strongly believes in moisturizing. Always, always after the shower, I fully moisturize my entire body because soft skin is important. It's also good not to be ashy. It also helps you not age as fast, not get fine lines, wrinkles, etc. It keeps your skin youthful, amazing, hydrated. I am a firm believer in moisturization and I love lotions. I use them all the freaking time. I would consider myself a lotion body butter master. Like I am a pro because I use them all the freaking time. So immediately what I notice about this product is it is, uh, it's creamy, but it's not too thick, which I appreciate because when lotions are really thick, <laughs> don't mind me just rubbing this on my hands right now as I film the video. Thick lotions, they take a really long time to like rub in and soak into your skin, which I'm not a fan of. But also if lotions are too liquidy, then I feel like they don't actually really do much moisturization for your skin, which can kind of be a problem because that's what you bought them for and that's what you are using the lotions for. So you kind of want them to do their job. But what I really like about this formulation is that it's creamy and it's not too thin, it's not too thick. I like that when I put on this lotion and I let it settle into my skin, once it dries and once I am moisturized, but I don't have, you know, the residue of the lotion still on me, I still smell like the lotion, which I really love. Honestly, what is the point of having a smelly lotion if I'm not gonna smell like the smelly goodness of the lotion? Moving on to the shower gel. One thing that I hate about shower gels is sometimes if you don't use a good one, Immediately after you have finished washing off your bod and you rinse off all of the shower gel that you just like lathered into your body, you feel dry again. Like sometimes I use a shower gel and a body wash and immediately afterwards I will feel dried the hell out and I will be like a crispy little cracker in the shower, which is not what I want. Luckily, this shower gel does not do that. It has a great consistency. It is a very nice gel consistency because it's a shower gel. You know how it is. When you use this, the entire shower smells like wonderful, wonderful goodness. I love it. Also, it does not dry out my skin like I said before, which I love in a shower gel. Plus, it does its job of cleaning my body, which is what I want a shower gel to be able to do. Clean my body, which is why 
I use it. Both of these products are absolutely wonderful. If you are not really keen on this particular Japanese cherry blossom smell, don't worry, Bath & Body Works got you covered because they have so many different smells. Either way, the formulations of both of these products is amazing. I have no complaints about either one of them because they both do exactly what I want them to and they don't do any of the things that I don't want them to. So there is nothing I can really complain about either of these two products. If you are interested in buying either of these products, I'll put their links in the description down below. Also, if you are a beauty guru YouTuber and you make reviews such as the one that you just watched that I just made, I will put a link to the website Octali that I got the hookup with Bath & Body Works for. I'll put a referral link for them in the description down below. So if you are a beauty YouTuber, go ahead, click that link in the description down below and you can get hooked up with some of your own free products too to make reviews for, which is epic, awesome, fun, amazing. That is it for this video. If you like to give it a like, comment down below. What is your favorite smell at Bath & Body Works? And if you have not been to Bath & Body Works, why not? Why not? I need to know. Just kidding. But like, you need to go. Like if you haven't been, if you're someone who likes bath products, bath, body, works, you need to go to Bath & Body Works. It just makes sense. You know, two plus two equals four, et cetera, et cetera. Subscribe to be notified the next time I make a video and I will see you cool cats the next time that I make a video. Bye. Uh, it smells like what I would imagine an angel would smell like. I don't know why. All right, um, I'm gonna go now. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna squeeze past here. All right, bye guys.